Well, good afternoon to you. Alexander and I are still contemplating that podcast. As we get into it, I'm going to give you a view of what transpired this morning with the time lapse over City Cam 8. You can see here, yeah, those clouds kind of billowed on in from mostly cloudy to cloudy. In fact, we started to open up the skies a little bit earlier, around the 9 o'clock hour or so, and we put some clouds back. But now we're getting back to at least partly cloudy skies to settle in for the afternoon, possibly getting to mostly sunny by the time the day is done. Areas north of I-10 may keep those clouds, unfortunately, so you may still see some mostly cloudy to possibly partly cloudy skies for you. This area of low pressure, this is going to just swoop in on us coming out of Canada and continue to, well, keep the cool down. Maybe we may see at a degree or two warmer taking us back into the mild. And, of course, that rainfall will be late coming. In fact, we'll see some of it maybe try to sneak in in the early morning for the first round and then come back again into the evening hours, say, just after uh, 8 o'clock or so. Clouds decrease today, though. Cooler conditions. We'll go into Thursday with the late storm as I've mentioned here and we'll give you a better view of that in just a bit but check it out there as I showed you earlier the uh, radar is a little bit quiet right now in fact it's been quiet just period across the cross uh, over the last couple of days now it's just eerily quiet um, again you're going to be looking at the clouds opening up you can see that uh, for lacrosse all the way down to Prairie du Chien and you take a look at Eau Claire you're still in some of the cloud cover so you're at least partly to mostly cloudy skies and then uh, of course you'll see some clouds kind of clearing out of your way getting into the evening hours by nine o'clock and more clouds are probably be on the way. Why? Because it's coming out of the out of the uh, west there, crossing the Mississippi, bringing in maybe a light sprinkle to maybe a light uh, brief shower into the area. And as we go into the 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock hour, you're seeing that line from Minneapolis all the way down, edging closer to the Mississippi. Once it gets here, well, it looks pretty ominous, but it's been breaking down lately. That's about 9 o'clock, right, at night. Then we go to 10 o'clock at night. Then it begins to weaken. Then we have maybe a brief storm possibly getting our area or maybe just a strong shower. By 11 o'clock, it starts getting out of the way. Prairie to though, you're picking up some good looking storms right there and that continues on all the way to uh, Friday at the two o'clock hour in the morning and that, they're holding on to the last bit of that rainfall and that gets out of the way as we finish out going into the uh, mid to late morning hours. All right, that being said, this is what we're expecting. This is a lot better than it showed uh, earlier this morning. We're looking at up uh, maybe an inch and a half in some areas. Wisconsin Dells for us, we're about still at a quarter of an inch. Not much change there, but Eau Claire has significantly changed about an inch and a half and the same for Lady Smith. All right, that that being said, we get to the zones here. We're going to see who's getting what out there. And you can see in some cases, well, this thing is always kind of playing with me here. So you're looking at upper 70s and the again, the lower 80s to middle 80s today. You're going to see that continue on for the south zone as well. Then we take it back up to the central zone. And here you go. Winona about 78 degrees. We're looking at some other locations holding on the middle 70s to the low 80s. And once we take it back up to the north zone, you can see all these temperatures still holding on to those low 70s. Get out and enjoy it if you can. Hey, we take a look at what's playing out for the next few days. We go into tomorrow some late storms starts off at a 40% chance then it goes all the way up to about an 80% chance for the nighttime and then it starts to wane as we go into the overnight hours it'll probably turn into about a 50% chance that being said we'll take it into Friday we're looking at sunnier skies we'll call it partly cloudy skies with more sunshine on the way for your Labor Day holiday man oh man get out and enjoy that I miss going to uh, out with friends from LA and kind of having fun yeah, where was the place to be during Labor Day uh, in LA? We used to go, what's it, what's it called? I can't even remember it now. It's like a poor man's Vegas kind of thing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Were you talking to me I about that yesterday? I was talking about yesterday, yeah. Poor man's Vegas has been on your mind yeah, quite a bit lately. Fun, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Art.